Ice Mandarin, a word in a minute. Today we are going to talk about a word called dou. Dou, d o u, first tone. Dou in Chinese means both, all, as an adverb. In English, the word all can be used as an adverb, or an adjective, or a pronoun. But these are actually three different expressions in Chinese. Dou is the adverb all and both in Chinese, which usually is used in front of a verb, like 我都喜欢 I like all of them. 他们都知道 They all know it. 我们都不去 All of us won't go. The translations of dou sound more like a noun here, but dou. Actually, is used for describing the verb to emphasize the actions. And the adjective "all" in Chinese is 所有的 and we use it in front of a noun, like 我所有的朋友 all my friends, 所有的国家 all the countries, 所有的中国人 all the Chinese people. And the "all" to refer Everything, as the pronoun in Chinese is, 一切一切 is a quite formal word compared to the 所有的 plus object structure. We use 一切 in the case like, 祝你一切顺利 wish everything is smooth with you. Different from English, in Chinese, 都 as the adverb all is used a lot in the sentences. Whenever the subject of the sentences is the word like 你们我们大家 or 每个人每天 usually there is a do after it. Although in English we usually don't need an all after these subject words, like to say everyone all likes it, we all like it. All is really not necessary to be here. However, in Chinese. Since the English word "every one" can be translated as "da jia," which means "big crowd," everyone, as the collective concept, and also can be taken as "mei ge ren," which means "each one, everyone," for an individual concept. So to use "do" after these words sort of complete the meaning here. So, 你都听懂了吗 Do you understand everything? 我一点都没听懂 I didn't understand it at all. All right, do for today. Thank you.